Good morning, and today we're doing Demon Gargoyle Cup. What, what, we're doing new units in RTA. It's an exhibition match between S Fox and Allstate. Both of them have similar RTA ranks. I think highest was Conqueror. And they have to draft demons and gargoyles. If they have gargoyles, they have to draft. I mean, both of them demons, and you can't ban the demons or gargoyles. All of them have to be in the game. This is a best of three, and I will fight the winner for a $25 gift card. Uh, at the end of this. So, first pick for Allstate goes to the Dark Demon versus Fire Demon of S-Fox. I believe S-Fox also has a Gargoyle. So there we go. We have a Demon Gargoyle draft com coming out from S-Fox. Um, what is the name of this one? Damon, right? I don't know his name. The, the, the Fire one. Fire versus Dark Demon. And then Allstate securing the Speed Leader as well as Beta. There's a lot of revives! There's three revivers here. There is three, no, Vanessa revives, the Dark Demon revives, the Beta revives, but S-Fox flexing back the other way with a Lima to, to take care of the immunity buffs. But it does look like S-Fox is in trouble based on this draft. From what I know about the Dark Demon, is that it ignores defense, it has infinity revives. So what do you do? Do you target the Dark Demon first, or do you leave it for last? I think you leave it for last, right? You, because if it has high HP, the Dark Demon doesn't ignore defense, right? Actually, I can't even... I don't even... I don't even really know. Anyway, Molong picked up by Alstay. And last pick, Diana. As Fox right here on to his last pick. Uh, what does he need right here? For sure, the demons and the gargoyles are going to be let through. That is the rules of the game. And he goes in Ramahan. It's an odd pick, but... Uh, he goes with it anyway. He can't ban the Dark Demon. So what is the ban there? Is the ban going to be... The Beta? Or is it going to be the Diana? Which would it be? I think Beta would be a good ban. Or, but then you've got Lima to strip. Right? You've got Lima to strip. So the, the Beta doesn't seem to be that uh, a much of a problem. Since you've got Lima to strip anyway. So uh, I'll stay. Very sporting. Bans out the Water Fairy. Instead of Lima. And uh, we're gonna see demons versus demons. And I think if Lima gets the strip off, we can see a Malite provoke. Assuming this Malite has accuracy. Because a lot of people, they pull this Wind Gargoyle. Yeah, and they ruin it with defense, tanky stats. But it doesn't have accuracy, you can't land the, 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 the provoke. It's very important to land uh, uh, the provoke. So very fast uh, beta right here. Taking turn one, getting the buff stuff. Molo is gonna be able to go. Doesn't get a single stun. And here we have the demon's first turn. Dark demon's first turn. I think Belzy bu Belzy buff. Oh my god! <laughs> Yo! What is it? That's so much damage! What the heck? What happened? That's your Wait, what? Anyway, line up with the strip. Okay, line up with the strip. Yo, we didn't even see the dark the other fire demon! <laughs> Lima procs the violent. Okay, okay. So there is one chance right now. Oh no. Oh, oh, Dark Demon's gonna take the turn. It's, go it's gonna cut. Dark Demon's gonna potentially cut. If he lets the defense break. Oh, an additional turn. He could very well go for the reckless assault right here. No, he didn't go for it. But with the defense break, we're gonna see a Dark Demon chop right now onto this Lima. It's gonna do like, I think. Possibly lethal damage? I don't know. 1,000? 12,000. Okay, Malite's turn to go. If he can secure a 4-man four, four provoke, he has a chance. That's a 3-man... Uh, two. Wait, what? Uh, that's a 3-man provoke. That's not good enough. That's not good enough. That's not good enough for you to, to refresh the cooldowns. He needed a 4-man provoke right there to refresh the cooldowns. So only 2-man two, uh, two provoke. And uh, it's, it's likely that, uh, I mean, it's, uh, nothing really Vanessa can do here, but just default attack to anybody. Yeah, there's no strip. And Molong lands the defense break onto this Gargoyle. However, uh, the Dark Demon's attacking the Gargoyle, potentially reducing the cooldown so you can provoke again. But because there is no more cleanse from Lima, Lima already used the cleanse. This means that this Gargoyle is going to be in some trouble right now. This Gargoyle is not gonna be, uh, this Gargoyle is probably gonna be dead right now. 
Yeah, yeah, it's probably dead before it can. Oh, and the reckless assault as well. The reckless assault as well to uh, to finish the job. So this is looking pretty bad for S Fox. I don't think he's got no more demons. He's got no more gargoyles. First round goes the way of Elstay, and we are heading to game number two. So here we have the pre bands Vanessa being banned out by Elstay and Lima. I mean, Vanessa banned out by S Fox. And Lima banned out by uh, Alstay, Mr. Dark Demon. Uh, and uh, here we go into the draw. First pick for S Fox. Gonna be a demon, fire demon. This fire demon, I can't click on it because we don't have the the same mod powers as SWC tournaments. I can't see what it does. I kind of remember that his third skill does something like continuous damage or something along the lines of that. However, we didn't get a chance to see it. So maybe S Fox can draw some protection for this demon. So that we can see this uh, demon do something. Uh, I'll stay going with the beta into beta into the dark demon again. It worked well for him. No reason to change that. What are the second waves for S Fox going to be? Going to be a Ciara, uh, but be because he's running a Ciara, he's going to need a stripper uh, to get rid of the immunity from this beta. Uh, what uh, and Lima is being bad now, but he does secure the speed leader though. Yeah, so he at least should get turn one. Running out of time, uh, time has run out, he goes with... What does this guy do? The, the R5 thing. He goes with the R5 thing, the KB5 thing. What's his face? Ba Bailiger. Against... He knew there was going to be more long though. Like, this questionable draft. Questionable draft. <laughs> Anyway, Gany Molong by Alstay. This guy is fighter, but he is ready. Okay, he's ready to take that $25 gift card off me. Uh, S-Fox finishing up his last wave of picks with the Wind Pixie and Wusa. Wusa is a good pick because there are currently no strippers on the side of Alstay. And having immunity uh, against Ga will render Gany useless because Steel Magic, you know, doesn't work if you got immunity. However, uh, it's a very fire-heavy draft from Asphalt. I don't know if he can deal with this 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 Mo Long uh, effectively. Last pick immunity by Alstay. Hmm. If that the means there are two damage sources here, and you can only ban you can't ban the Dark Demon, right? Because those are the rules of today's fight. So if you ban Mo Long, that means that there's only one damage source being the Dark Demon. Is that the right ban, or is banning Beta the right ban? I don't know. Anyway, Alstay goes ahead with the Wusa ban. So again, no immunity for S Fox, no protection for S Fox. If turn one is 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 Alstay, he's gonna kill the fire demon without the fire demon having a chance again. Because there's no protection for S Fox. Unless Shannon what does Shannon do? Shannon buffs defense, right? No, turn one beta? Who gets turn two? Turn 2 for Shannon, okay. So that's pep talk, defense buff, and attack buff. But there's immunity. So, the, I believe the fire demon... I believe what the fire demon does... Is... Damage over time. Am I right? I want to say that. But with permanent immunity. With permanent immunity on the side of... Uh, on the side of... Uh, what's his face? I'll say. The fire demon is not going to be able to do... Oh my god, this Dark Demon does so much damage. And there's no heals. Is he gonna kill the Dark Demon? Is he gonna... Uh, wait, wait, wait. Relajo is gonna try uh, attack into this fire. Okay, one chance for the Fire Demon to do something. Does he go for the finish of the Dark Demon? Goes for this AoE attack. 14,000. Okay, so the Dark Demon is dead. Dark Demon is dead. The Fire Demon looks like... Uh, he, he, he can sustain himself when he uses second skill because he sucks HP back, right? So now, he can't even kill the Dark Demon again. He could possibly kill the Dark Demon again with Ciara. But maybe not with a bomb. A default attack should kill, finish the job here. It looks like. But it's dangerous. Oh, he doesn't go for the Dark Demon kill. He's going to get Steel Magic. Attack Blast is going to be reduced. And the Dark Demon is going to steal the turn. Why? Why did it... Wait, uh huh? But then he killed the Dark Demon! Now the Dark Demon is low HP! And the Dark Demon at low HP does crazy damage! 
Oh, but, but he doesn't have second skill. Dark Demon doesn't have second skill right now. The second skill does ignore the defense damage. So Banager has one chance to do something. The, the uh, uh, Fire Lightning Emperor has one chance. Okay, gets a kill and destroys HP. So now, uh, does this Fire Demon have the Life Leech? Because if he doesn't, he's gone. What, does, what is his skill? Is he got a third skill? I think this is the third skill, right? It doesn't do anything. <laughs> because there's immunity, or you need some continuous damage or something. Uh, from what I remember. Anyway, Fire Demon is dead. It's a 3v3 situation, but five stacks on Banager. Which means Banager can, uh, I don't know if I'm pronouncing his name right, the Fire Lightning Emperor. Five stacks right now. Both demons out of the game. But I do know that the Dark Demon's coming back. It's coming back. Right? The moment you kill somebody, the Fire Demon comes back. I think he comes back. Because I've seen some videos of that. I think he comes back. Anyway, Ciara has one chance to put a bomb. One chance for Ciara to put a bomb. Oh! The chance is gone again. The chance is gone again. Can this the manager kill? Not of damage. Not of damage, but a lot of the HP destroyed. Means, which means the next time, the next time this, this, this manager attacks, things are gonna die. However, Ciara is gonna be dead here without a single bomb being put out. Is there another, another thing that Shannon can do? Decrease attack by all of this villager. Seal magic. That's gonna actually kill. That's gonna actually kill. So Badger has one chance here. He Badger can possibly kill two units right now, I think. He can possibly kill two units. By I mean Badger, I mean the uh, Firelight Emperor. But no, there's gonna be more immunity. However, however, he can kill. He can kill Ganymede. With the default attack. Okay. But then that brings back the Dark Demon! That brings back the Dark Demon! But wait, it doesn't kill! The Dark Demon doesn't have a third skill! So all that needs to happen right now is for Banager to steal the turn! I mean, for a Lightning Emperor! If the Lightning Emperor moves first, he can win! But who's gonna move first? It's the Dark Dark Thing! Oh, with the push, the Dark Thing is gonna move! He chomps, but doesn't get the kill! Does he go for the kill again? He goes for the kill! But wait! But wait, no! The Dark Emperor, I think, is gonna come back again! I think the Dark... I mean, the, 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 the Dark Demon! The Dark Demon is going to come back again, right? Even if he kills right now. Even if the Shannon gets the kill of this village wall. Oh wait, it doesn't come back. Wait, what? I don't understand. It, uh, but, but it's over, right? Because Beta can revive. Beta can revive. Beta can revive. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there's a 5 turn cooldown. My bad. There's a 5 turn cooldown on the Dark Demon. It's not like... It's not like free of charge. It's not free of. It's not. It's, it's not. It's not. It's not infinite. <laughs> There's no way Shannon wins this though against uh, against Ganny and and the Reviver. Shannon doesn't have enough damage to to do that. But close though. I think that uh, there was a window where he could have made something happen, but uh, it was a either a misclick or misplay. Uh, the problem is there was too much immunity on the side of Elstay. So I will go against Elstay. That was a pretty okay match. The second match was way better. Was way better than the first match. I think anyway. So I get first pick, and I have to pick the the demons, right? So uh, I remember his drop. I think I want to ban out the beta, because I don't want to deal with it. Or I could deal with it. Actually, I don't care about the beta. I don't care about the beta. I think I'm gonna ban... The, ban, ban, ban the Ganyme then, yeah? Uh, pesky unit. Yeah? Ban a maid every single time. Every single time. So it's gonna be Wind Demon versus Dark Demon. I think I have first pick, so I dropped the Wind Demon. And I think he dropped the Dark Demon. And Vanessa. And so I'm gonna take away his Mo Long. Oh wait, 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 wait a minute. Wait a minute. This Dark Demon ignores defense. Eh? It ignores, it ignores defense. Should I be afraid? It ignores defense, though. Oh. Should I be afraid here? I don't know. I feel like I should. It could one-tap me. The, does it do big damage? Does it do big damage? This Dark Demon. No, the second skill. Okay, he starts off with a Leo pick. 
I mean, I mean, it's, it ends up with the leaf. I'm gonna ban the Diana here. I feel like Diana is the most scary thing, right? So he bans my Bulwark. That's a smart, smart choice. Banning the Bulwark. Because Bulwark would get insane amount of sustain. Because there is immunity from beta and whatnot. So my play here, I have to take out this Dark Demon right away. Right? I have to take out Dark Demon right away. I'm not really bothered about the rest. As long as we can kill this Dark Demon first. But with the Speed Leader, he's gonna be able to dish out some damage. Right away, he's gonna be able to do some big damage to me. Yeah. I believe I need to get defense buff right now. I can't even try and take a risk here. Oh, wait, what? Oh, wait, what? No, wait, shit! If I go on the Dark Demon right now... I can't! Because if I go on the Dark Demon right now, I drop him low, and he ignores defense on me! So I can't. I have to do the, the safe play here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's dangerous. That's dangerous. So, oh, shit. He's pretty low now. He's pretty low. Oh my god, he lands the defense break. We're gonna kill this Dark Demon. Get it out of the way. Get it out of the way. He can't revive, okay? He can't revive. And we heal up my Molong. Alright. And then we... I say we chop into... Chop into the beta. Chop into the beta. That's right. Chop into the beta. If I went reckless assault into that Dark Demon... It will be over for me. It will be absolutely over for me. <laughs> because a Dark Demon would have returned. I mean, we, uh, would have uh, would have just one-shot me. Okay, so I got a problem now. The problem is, uh, my Molong is hurt. Hurt bad. And he's going to take a lot of damage. Because of his defense break that somehow landed, right? He's going to take a lot of damage. We're going we're gonna to drop this Vanessa, actually. Vanessa is the defense breaker. He's scary. Shit. Do I sacrifice my Molong here? Yes! S screw it! Let's sack the Molong! Let's sack the Molong! So Leo takes out my Molong. Yeah? Leo takes him out. It's a closer fight now. Oh shit! Oh shit! Wait a second! Um, let's go on this Leo. Yeah? Let's go. Let's chop this Leo down. Oh! Okay. Oh wait! Wait, wait, wait a second! If he, if he kills my Mephisto before I kill the Leo, I'm in big trouble too. We need to freeze this guy. Uh oh! Uh oh! Oh shit, he's proccing violence! He's proccing the violence! Let's heal up. Let's heal up. Let's heal up. We chop this one now. We chop this one now. I think we can go on this Leo. Yeah, because we got full attack bars. We got full- it doesn't matter how many violence because we got immunity right now. And I think this kills. Okay. <laughs> so it's very easy, guys. If you see Dark Demon, bring the Wind Demon. And you save $25 right there. <laughs> We're on DV Zoul's account. This guy is the, the giveaway winner, Kai Jin Ting. I had him verify over email. So he uploaded a, a video of uh, Orange or something. And we're gonna do something for him. We're gonna buy... Which pack? The biggest one, right? Did I, did I say the biggest one? I think it was. Because when I pulled the demon, I made a giveaway, giveaway video. When I pulled the demon. And I said we're gonna buy... The, the, the big pack, right? So, in order for us to do summons on the big pack, we buy the LD scroll. Am I right? We buy the LD scroll, and I'm gonna ask him what color, what attribute do you want? Two legendaries, six LDs, 42 water scrolls. And we start off with two mystical scrolls first. Good luck to you, okay? This guy stopped playing Summoner's War for a while, just came back. So, Summoner's War is gonna bless him. With some good luck in order to keep this customer. You know what I'm saying? That's how these games work. It's a fact. Yeah? Because if I were to design a game, that's how I would rig, rig my gacha anyway. So 42, I think we're going for a water demon here. That's 42 water scrolls. I don't think I've ever summoned so many elemental scrolls in my life, have I? Not even Fortiana. Never so many before. Holy shit, these raids are trash. <laughs> this is a... A casual player! Casual player supposed to have good reads, come to us. Yo, what is this? Oh, what is this? What are these raids? Welcome back raids. <laughs> what is this raid? 42 water, no lightning, bro.
He's gonna be net five. Damn! One in twenty. One in twenty-two. Lightning. Since a while back, your rates are one in thirty. Jesus Christ! Well, we've got two in thirty now. But I mean, chilling. Two now. We had one lightning for mysticals. Did we? Oh, three now. Did we have one lightning for mysticals? I think we did, right? Oh my God! What the four red to back left? Wait, what? What? <laughs> Bruh! Uh, welcome back to Summoner's War! Welcome back! <laughs> Even I found it! I, I was a little salty there. I, I mean, I know people that try 10,000 summon stones for Bulwark. Comes up empty. What the fuck? Four lightnings back to back, and then the last one Bulwark. Welcome back to Summoner's War, okay? <laughs> it doesn't even matter if we get anything else here. It doesn't even matter, right? You don't care anymore. Bulwark is so good. Especially if you were fighting that guy just now. I'll stay. He likes to pick Beta. And drop the Bulwark. He's done for. You know? Damn. 42 Water Scrolls is all you need. All you new players out there. 42 Water Scrolls. It's all you need to get Bulver. Wow. Great rates. Welcome back package. Only works if you're casual though. So you can't complain about the rates now. Because we had four lightnings. Let's check the lightning. Real quick. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six lightnings in 42 water scrolls. And three mystical scrolls. 45 scrolls. Six lightnings. Wait. One, two, three, four, five. Sorry. Five lightnings. Five lightnings in 45. And one of them is a net five. You can't complain. It's not even a dupe, right? It's not even a dupe. So, you can't complain. It's, it's great. It's good stuff. Now, legendary scroll time. Give him a dupe right now, to be honest. <laughs> give this guy a dupe. I mean, this, he got a free pack. He won the giveaway. This is free. One in 5,000, he won the giveaway. Gets a ball working 42 water scrolls. Give him a dupe. Come on. Give this man a dupe. Awaken five stars. <laughs> huh? No lightning. I'm just gonna burn through this. I'm just gonna burn through this. Ah, that's why you don't buy LD scrolls, my friends. Because LD scrolls have shitty rates. <laughs> that's why you don't buy LD scrolls. Okay, we are done. We're done. Congratulations. Kai Jin Ting, aka DVZIL. I, I like to buy a vowel somewhere in there. Won the giveaway. One in 5,000, pretty much. And then gets a Bulwark in 42 scrolls. And what are the rates for the Bulwark? It's like point... Go see a doctor. <laughs> Check if anything's wrong somewhere, because life is bad, all right? Gargoyle scroll? Is there a Gargoyle scroll? Oh, you're right. Let's do the Gargoyle scroll. Let's do the Gargoyle scroll as well. Let's just summon it. Yeah, yeah. I think among the gargoyles, the wind and the the wind and the fire one seem decent. I don't really like the water one. It's okay, but I don't really like it that much. Seems like a boring unit. So I hope you get the water one. <laughs> Since you like water scrolls, I'll huh? give you the water one. Ah, he got he got the wind one. Ah, congratulations! This one's good. This one's good. It's pretty good. Okay, so we're gonna stop here. Thank you for watching. Uh, but, I mean, we'll do more giveaways. For those of you who didn't win, we'll do more giveaways in the future. Every time I do a sponsored video, I make some money. I always do some giveaways as well. So don't worry about that, okay? Um, yeah, I'm gonna stop here.
Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye. Hero, you too got